Time now to head out to the new zoo. Neil Anderson joins us live from Suamico, not with skunks this morning. We were mm. talking about those <laughs> earlier, but you're with the snow leopards, right? Absolutely. And Rachel, I've yes. got some weekend perf perfume for you. It's very it's nice. Not yeah. Every weekend, it's I don't just know if you like this. Weekends. I don't know what I don't know what brand it is, but it's purple, so I, <laughs> I'm sure it must smells be pretty purple. good. <laughs> yeah, it must be outstanding. Actually, you, you know what? So the snow generous. leopards love this. <laughs> really? And uh, what's the smell you know, like? We use this. Out, you know, we use this. <laughs> Out, out in the exhibit. I hate to ask. Yeah, it's enrichment <laughs> because they love to smell all this different stuff. You know, what so is that really smell? the smellier the better. Okay. Is it real perfume? And that's real perfume. Oh, it is. Okay. You know, it's probably like a dollar for that bottle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love that. Stuff that you got your mom yeah, in grade school. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, yeah, it really lasts a while. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like I say, they love that <laughs> cinnamon, peppermint, all that kind of stuff is. You know, cinnamon is probably their favorite. You know, so we'll go ahead and we'll put that around. And I know you guys were talking a little bit about skunks earlier. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I, ha and I have to tell you, I mean, we're at the snow leopard right now, but one of the uh, worst procedures I was involved with working with uh, a veterinarian was at a park in Illinois. Uh -huh. And we had a program skunk, which we had to descent. Okay. And I'm going to tell you that, that is not a fun process oh. because it's a certain... It was a surgical process, yeah. and what you had to do is we had to take a glass pane, and we had to hold the skunk underneath there. Of course, the skunk, you know, at that particular time was sedated and everything, but spraying up on the glass, and we had a big barn fan in the back of a vet clinic, and I can you, I smelt like a skunk for about two weeks. Oh. I just could not get that smell. Yeah, that was, uh, so, you know, I did so that gross. once. That's off the bucket list. <laughs> That's not happening anymore. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Kind of concerns me that that was even on stuff. your bucket list. But. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I didn't know it was either. <laughs> <laughs> but you check that one off, don't but, need to do it again. <laughs> absolutely. But hey, we're with, with the snow leopards. You see, they, they're getting along just fantastic, and we're hoping that this year uh, that they will produce uh, a, a cub or two, which would be fantastic for the program. They're an endangered species. And, you know, one of the things that we are looking at doing with this exhibit, we've got a, we got a donation from uh, Lee and Kathy Anderson to go ahead. And this is one of our, our older exhibits. And it originally, you know, had been a jaguar exhibit, baboon exhibit. And then we were able to bring snow leopards in, and so we're kind of settled in with the snow leopards here. But we're going to go ahead and do something similar to what we did with our snow monkey exhibit. Uh, different mesh for the front, so the viewability will, will look a, a lot better for the visitors. And then the back side of this building, we used to have wallabies in. And we're going to change that so the whole building itself will be designed for snow leopards. Oh. And we're going to get working on that uh, this year. So they're really going to see a major upgrade, rock work, everything in here. And, uh, and hopefully uh, with this pair, they're going to be here for quite a while. Uh, the one's 13, one's 11. And, you know, they can live up to about 20 years old. But it's a great program for the zoo to be involved with. You know, it's been uh, kind of mild for January. Um, have you noticed any difference in visitors there at the zoo or is it pretty much steady from last year? No, I, I will say this is uh, the attendance is, is more than doubled last year Wow! Uh, for the month of January. Now, you know, the one thing too is, you know, remember January and February this year, we went with a reduced half price admission. Mm -hmm. So I think that helped, but obviously the weather, weather has really yeah. helped out a lot too. Great. Great time to come out and visit the zoo. Yeah. Yeah. Bring your perfume. <laughs> yeah, bring your perfume. Well, Neil, thanks a lot for uh, for filling us in. All right. You just send that bottle of perfume back with you, and Rachel put the that. The amount on. of love I feel for the two of you is uh, indescribable. I, I will do that. It'll it'll last you all weekend. There you go. <laughs> thanks, thanks, Neil. Have a great one. See ya. Hey.